Wirklich? Bist du an der Uni? Was machst du? Osmosis, Jörg? 600 Jahre Tradition und Geschichte in dieser Säule. I'm trying to get my head around it. Literally. Apparently, Goethe wrote one of his poems right here. <laughs> Duncan. It's pronounced Goethe. Oh, I knew that. Are you on a Marai, Jörg? Ja, yeah, Professor Tracy brings us here on a Fachschaftsfahrt. A big pardon, Jörg? Fach. Schafts. Fahrt. Jeez, sounds a bit traumatic. Nein, es ist super. We are singing songs. Kawaiata, Kiamaria. Pressing our noses together. And in the evening, we are even pulling on all our clothes and sleeping on old mattresses. There's so little social hierarchy in your country. In Germany, I'm not so often spooning with my professor. You're telling me, Jörg? I found it quite hard to even locate mine. Mm-hmm. Uh-huh. Mm. -hmm. Ah. Uh -huh. mm. oh. Heute Morgen mussten wir uns im Farinui vorstellen. So, why New Zealand, Jörg? Morena, Professor Tracy. Class? New Zealand passed my three criteria for study abroad. Criteria one. Is it a safe country? Oh, breaking news. Hmm, seems pretty safe. Criteria two. Is it beautiful? <gasps> the nature. Ja. Criteria three. A world-class education? And that, Tracy, is why I chose Neuseeland. But then I've noticed a strange change in the Faranui. Of course I was accepted for the honors class as I achieved the highest results in the international relations course and was awarded the prize for the most promising cultural ambassador. Thank you, Your Excellency, the Right Honorable Royal Prime Minister Ms. Adern. Congratulations, Jürg, and, and please just call me Jacinda. I'm also super talented at volleyball. Oh, kapai. Hmm. Yeah, was there a sudden silence in the room, Jörg? Did your classmates avoid eye contact for several minutes afterwards, perhaps? Ja, was habe ich gemacht? Well, Jörg, you went from praising New Zealand, widely encouraged, to praising yourself, highly problematic. Warum? Unlike in Germany, where, especially in crowded bakeries, the idea seems to be to push yourself ahead of the crowd, <laughs> In New Zealand, the crowd's pretty small, Jörg, and ever so slightly insecure. You want to stay in it. It's a kind of social duty to keep your head down, undersell yourself a bit, so you don't come across as too clever or a bit too good. But I don't think I'm too good. I'm just proud of myself. Darf ich das nicht zeigen? Yeah, na, es ist ein komplexes Thema, Jörg. Aber hol mal deinen Ordner. I'm channeling some bullet points. In New Zealand, if you happen to achieve something marvelous, the first step is to say nothing at all. Ah, nicht das schon wieder. The Kiwi hero is above all a humble one. Keep your achievement under your hat, Jörg. Unless it happens to be extraordinary. In which case you may move on to step two. Wait for a friend to bring it up for you. If I was in your position, Jörg, I might choose to carelessly leave evidence of my achievements lying around the Whadanui. Sooner or later, word would get around. Hey, Trace, did you know Duncan got top marks on his essay on dolphin reproduction? And then you can celebrate, yeah? Inwardly, yeah, but outwardly, nine. Step three, Jörg, is to publicly deny the importance of the achievement. Like this. Did you, Dunk? Um, no. I mean, it was nothing. Pretty easy topic, really. If, however, the achievement is undeniably brilliant, 
Step four is to acknowledge your success, but attribute it to a group effort. What can I say? I had a great team behind me, guys. Aber warte mal, Dank, ich hatte kein Team. Ich alleine bin most promising cultural ambassador. Okay, okay, ganz ruhig. This calls, Jürg, for the very rare step five. Accept your achievement. But keep it very brief, and most importantly, change the subject as soon as possible. Nah, this is seriously good, mate. It's changed the way I think about marine mammals. Oh, cheers, Jaden. Hey, did you guys hear? Apparently there's another seal on the road. Duncan, du bist manchmal eine echt große Hilfe. Ich? Oh, nein. Doch, du erklärst Sachen einfach so gut. Stimmt nicht. Man könnte so ein animiertes Lehrvideo daraus machen. Ach, hör auf. Na gut. Apparently, you're on the news. Good on you, mate. Oh, any seal could have done it. I think uh, you're the attraction, actually, Elizabeth. You see the sign? Oh, group effort, mate. Yeah, group effort.